Dear George, I'm looking for a 1 minute 57 second report featuring stories that have nothing to do with COVID-19. Kind regards, Mr. A Viewer. Well, first up, this Yorkshire-based couple have celebrated their 50th wedding anniversary and say that they have Bob Dylan to thank as they met on his birthday and they even named their only son after the singer. Martin Dove said it was love at first sight when he first saw Katie standing across from him in a pub. Well, in a bid to spark a conversation, the obsessive Bob Dylan fan asked her if she knew it was his birthday on that day that they met. Well, she didn't know, but uh, the pair danced the night away regardless and have not spent a minute apart since that fateful evening. Just over four months later, the smitten pair tied the knot and they now live in Scarborough. Well, congratulations to you both. Next, these eco-homes are part of the UK's biggest sustainable urban development with each airtight property boasting a low carbon footprint. The development near the River Air here in Leeds will contain 800 eco-homes fitted with the latest innovations in environmental design. The properties are made from timber, which is renewable and carbon negative, meaning it removes carbon dioxide from the atmosphere rather than adding it. Well, as with many new build homes now, the houses in Leeds Climate Innovation District have solar panels and many of the roofs are covered in green plants. And finally, Leeds-based restaurants Bundabus, The Athenian and Rosa's Thai Cafe have beaten thousands of restaurants across the UK to make the shortlist for Deliveroo's Restaurant Awards. The first round of public voting saw over 100,000 of you cast a vote and you've got until ne- November the 4th to support your favourite outlet. Well, uh, good luck to all of the shortlisted venues.